Hey guys, E here from Virginia Grace Living. So we're getting ready to head out to the, the Homesteaders of America conference in Front Royal, Virginia. So it should be a good time. Uh, but I got to get some things together and take care of the animals and stuff a little bit this evening because uh, we're going to get an early start tomorrow. Uh, it's just going to be me and the kids this time. Uh, we've been having some issues with our uh, puppies that have not been feeling too well. So. Uh, unfortunately, Tiff's not going to be able to make it. She's going to stay home with him. But it should give her a little bit of time and break. We've got uh, some about two and a half week old uh, kits in here. Oh, getting a little rambunctious. Their eyes are open and everything now. But they're getting bigger. Whoop, got some scragglers trying to get out. Hey, Coco. Hey, Minnie. Minnie. She's just chilling, buddy. Hi, Minnie. Hi, Minnie. What? He's what? not a girl. No, he's we, a boy. Mr. Goldberg is a sweet my son. Mm hmm. And he's my son, too. Mm hmm. All right, let's close it and go check on Belle. And here's Can Belle. Belle. No, we don't want to hold her. We'll just pet her. Hi, hold? Belle. She's being shy for the camera, but normally she lets me pet her. And then we got some grow outs down here that'll be processed can I, can I next week. Minnie. Minnie. What you got, dude? Did you pick it? Yeah. Is there another one? Where? I don't here, but uh uh, look right there. I'm gonna use my circle, my circle. Here, you want me to take that one? Mm -hmm. right. one Grab the other one. Yeah. We got a couple of overripe cantaloupes out of the garden mm -hmm. that I just didn't get to. Chickens are getting to them though; they love them. So anyways, we live in Virginia, but this is going to be kind of a, um, a decent drive for us. It is about three hours away, so we're going to be heading out in the morning and staying in, uh, in an Airbnb kind of near that area. So it should be a good time, just the kids and I, and we're going to try and do some outdoor cooking and stuff, and I'll keep you guys uh, in the loop with that. Uh, so anyways, next time you see me, it'll probably be bright and early and we'll be hitting the road. It's bright and early and we're heading to Homesteaders of America. You guys ready? Yeah. It's just us. I got a half pound. Dad and kids weekend, so we should have a good time, right? And we got Tic Tacs. He's got Tic Tacs and a hash brown, so he's good. Yeah. Alright. Alright, let's go. And we got a Hi, Levi. All right, we're here. All right, where do you want to go, guys? You just gonna start walking? All right. Well, let's let's go down the the rows and then we'll come check out stuff. See, he's forging a knife. Some jokes. So here's what we're here's what we are. 
you know, when you uh, when you sign up to do these things, you uh, you kind of not sure what you're getting into. So we don't have chickens. <laughs> we don't have hot water, and we don't have cold water. We have cones <laughs> on a cross. <laughs> so it's very apropos. Hey, Daddy, can I get one of those? She's like, do you have any uh, treats? Not today. She looks so like Reba. Like a cage of yeah. I don't know if they're allowed to touch them. Right, the McMurray Hatchery. Go check them out. We'll be over here, Levi. Come here. I think he's either Italian or Mexican. Maybe. All right, Levi and I are hanging out here by the fire. We're gonna make an easy camp meal tonight. It's just gonna be um, a Frito chili pie with the Dutch oven. So if you guys wanna hang out and watch how we're gonna do that, uh, you can. This is kind of like a old Boy Scout uh, recipe. Um, I'll post the link in the description if you wanna see the exact recipe, but you can do it however you want. We're gonna have some ground beef. Uh, we're gonna brown that and stuff first. And then drain that and get that out and put some tortillas in the bottom and then put the chips and the ground beef uh, over that and then add the cheese and everything so it should be a good time uh, hopefully we have enough firewood there was supposed to be a whole stack here uh, but we'll see what happens So what do you think so far, buddy? Having a good time? Mm-hmm. What's your favorite part of the day so far? Um, when we were driving, but it was a little tired, and when I also got um my red te teddy bear. Your red teddy bear? What's his name again? John? Very nice. He's funny. He has a funny voice. So we were at the Homesteaders of America conference for a little bit today, and we it walked around. Kinda... This is a little boring, but yeah. it's kind of fun at the end. Yeah, we saw Joel Salatin. We've seen him before, and he was doing a butchering uh, workshop, and uh, at first there were no chickens there, so he was doing a broiler uh, butchering demonstration, and uh, there were no chickens, so he just started talking for a while. I always like to hear Joel Salatin talk. He always has something wise to say, so we sat and listened for a little bit. We've butchered our own chickens a few times, so... They got a little bored, so they already know how to do all that stuff. All my kids have helped do every, all of that stuff, huh? Mm -hmm. All right, I think this is probably done. We're gonna double check it. Oh, I think we're good. Got a nice bubble going on over there. I'm sure that the chili's heated up. Everything else is cooked, and the cheese is melted. 
So we're gonna grab this off and put some in bowls and give it a try. hot. Yeah, I'm gonna let mine cool down a little bit. How's yours, buddy? Did you get some? It's not out. Good? Nice. Let me see that s'more. Dad, I got the ultimate s'more. Oh, yeah. Very nice. Dad, I got the ultimate Alright guys, well we're kind of getting settled in for the night. Uh, I think uh, it's been a great day so far. I've really enjoyed being together. More than anything, we just had a great time just hanging out together and, and doing stuff. And if you have a family, just make sure you always take time to uh, spend time with your kids and, and do things that, you know, maybe you enjoyed when you were a kid that, uh, that maybe they would enjoy, you know. Uh, so we've been having fun by the fire and whittling sticks and making s'mores and uh, just been really nice. So. We're gonna uh, turn in here soon. Uh, for now, that's all. Thanks for watching, guys. God bless.